Abstract Expressionism is a development of abstract art which originated in New York in the 1940s and 1950s and aimed at a subjective emotional expression with particular emphasis on spontaneous creative acts. Leading figures were Jason Pollock and William de Kooning. Abstract Expressionism emerged in a climate of Cold War politics and social and cultural conservatism. All were committed to an expressive art of profound emotion and universal themes, and most were shaped by the legacy of surrealism, of mo a movement which they translated into a new style fitted to post-war mood of anxiety and trauma. New York in 1940s and 1950s were stamped by the experience of the Great Depression, and they came to a minority whilst painting in styles influenced by social realism and the regionalist movement. The varied work produced by the abstract expressionists resists definition as a cohesive style. Instead, these artists shared an interest in using abstraction to convey strong emotional or expressive content. Artists include Jason Pollock, William de Kooning, Franz Kalein. Paul Jackson Pollock was born on January 28, 1912. When Pollock was eight, his father, who was an abusive alcoholic, left the family and Pollock's older brother, Charles, became like a father to him. But despite being busy with work, Pollock could not stop drinking. In 1937, he began receiving psychiatric treatment for alcoholism from a Dungarian analysis who fueled his interest in symbolism and Native American art. In 1939, Pollock discovered Pablo Picasso's show at the Museum of Modern Art. Picasso artistic experimentation encouraged Pollock to push the boundaries of his own work. Pollock's most famous paintings were made during this strip period, between 1947 and 1950. He became widely popular after being featured in a four-page spread on August 8, 1949, in Life magazine. Abstract expressionist painters explored new ways of creating art, reinvigorating and reinventing the medium. They changed the nature of painting with their large abstract canvases, energetic and gestural lines, and new artistic processes. Many artists experimented with non-traditional materials such as commercial paints and house painters brushes. Artists also developed new techniques to apply paint, such as moving the canvas from the easel to the floor 